time for Tampa Bay Music Headlines. Top story on the chart this week, the Tampa-based fanzine, The Termite, will release a 15-song compilation album of novelty songs, b-sides, and other assorted tunes from some of America's best independent rock bands. That will be this fall, and it's going to be called Spontaneous Consumer Frenzy. This album will feature songs from Seattle's Young Fresh Fellows, New York's Splat Cats, the X. The ex Catheads from San Francisco and LA's Divine Weeks and Firehose bassist Mike Watt. Fans from Florida with songs on this album include Gainesville's Vulgar Bolt Boatman, Vulgar Boatman, and Tampa artist Robert Wegman, The Woodies, The Immediates, Barons of Love, and Epic Trash. A local new release program is being planned for Inside Out for late September. Local bands interested in having their latest material aired should send their tapes to WMNF. I'll give the address in a moment. Inside Out is always looking for news. If you're a band, or if you're in a band, manage a club, or are a member of the musical community, and have some news to share, here is the address to mail to. Tampa, Inside Out, care of WMNF, 1210 East Buffalo Avenue, Tampa, 33603. And on next week's program, a recorded interview with Fetch and Bones. So stay tuned, everyone. Don't go far. We have Multicolor House coming up next. Waste Byproducts. It's a show, and it's on Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, from 2 a.m. to 5 a.m. on WMNF. If you dare be awake at that time, you too can tune us in. And remember, only you can prevent forest fires. Multicolor House with Because of Love.
That was nice. That was multicolor house there, and we have them in the studio right now. The multi-talented multicolor house. They've been around for a while. It's uh, vocalist Natty Moss Bond, guitarist Sam Bond, and bassist in uh, Sean Malone. And where's Bryce, the drummer? Well, he's, uh, he's I think he uh, I think he exploded with uh, Ellis Tellis drummer. He has drummer's disease. Oh God, it's pretty funny. Um, I like to get before we even get started. I, I I need to get something straight. Um, people bug me all the time. You know, I write the concert report, and all the time in there, you know, it's yes, just Sean. kind of a joke. Um, I just want to ensure, especially you, Sam, that um, I don't have. Everybody goes, "What do you have? The hots for Natty? You always write Natty Mouse Spawn featuring, you know, featuring that babe." It's like I just want to assure you, it's just like a kind of a running joke that Drew Farmer started, and I carried Drew it over. Farm I'm sure it was you that started it. Sean. Well, I put it in here, but he was the one who I don't know. I can't remember how it started. It was like a year ago, so I just like wanted like. And sure, like, everything's like cool. It's, it's kind of a joke because everybody's I'll like kids me on the station. The show, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that's pretty good. Well, they'll be playing tonight at the ACL Club in downtown St. Petersburg with Ellis Telly, and I heard the show went very well last night and very well attended. Yes, it was. It was packed, and we had a ton of fun. A ton of fun. Yes, we did. Fun. What kind of a crowd that goes to down to the? It's it's ACL a very club. interesting crowd at ACL. Uh -huh. There's um you know, a lot of tattoos, and. Uh, you might be scaring some people away. There, Maybe there we shouldn't a, say anything. There was a juggler there the other night, and uh, you know it's performed just between acts. <laughs> no, just there. <laughs> We've uh -huh. played there a lot, Sean. We've never gotten hurt. Never. Well, that's nice. Although I heard last night, I walked in the room and somebody said, I, "Sean, Sean and Sam were in a fight out front." <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. I was not no. down there. No, that it's Sean. A fine place. Our oh, bass oh, player, oh, Sean. Oh, oh, oh. A lot of room. They got food and it's uh, you know uh -huh. pool tables and stuff. If you get uh, tired of the music. That's good. Well, I hope they won't get tired of the music. Well, you should go down there, Sean. You never come to see us play. That's baloney. <laughs> That's total baloney. <laughs> I've seen you a lot. I just won't drive down to St. Pete. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you. <laughs> so you've been together for four, three, four, five, ten years. You're celebrating ten. your 25th anniversary. Yeah. No, three, <laughs> but four years? Um, we've been together. We've been playing together for four years. Uh -huh. Sam and I have We been. met at Woodstock. And, uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> You've gone through a lot of personnel changes, I mean, serious personnel changes. Yes, we have. Like yeah. about how many drummers and bassists have you gone through now? We've had um, three drummers, um, five oh, bass players. Five bass players and, and an extra singer that's not with us. And that's right. two guitar. or three guitar players. Extra ones, yeah, that's Yeah, right. you know. So how long has this lineup been together? We've been actually playing together with, as this lineup for about a year and a half. As Sean's, as Sean's been with us for two years, and um, this is... This is the way we like it now. That's good. <laughs> is there is there a big difference in sound than it was, or did I that lead the the change? Lead the changes there. Or? I really like our rhythm section right now. They mm -hmm. are very very talented. Used to have um, um the guy from um, playing guitar. Real cameras. Yeah, Ed, that's it. See, this is Ed the international. Curiel. This is the yeah. international signal for real cameras. Well, the three Ed, snaps of the yeah, finger. Yeah, Ed, um, Ed is now in Hollywood playing with a band called Shadowland with members of a new personality. They just got through. Oh no, are they together? Yes, yeah. they're, they just got re through recording a record in um, Wales. They're on Geffen Records, and they've got mm -hmm. the thing they're working on. It's kind of a. It's been described to me as a folksy sound. I can't imagine those of you around here have ever remembered a new well, personality. Well, there is a harmonic in there, I think. That may be it. Yeah. It's Sean. Robert Plant is playing harmonica on the album. It's true. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah. and one of the Water Boys is on the record, and uh, somebody from the Dream Academy is playing on the record. I heard those guys. Plug them, what? <laughs> we don't need to plug them. <laughs> no, but I heard those guys were going heavy metal. But on our album, though, we are uh, we've got some local celebrities that are such as such as uh, Bill Robert Berto. Robert Wegman, um, Drew Farmer. Say Robert Wegman r when you're really drunk, really <laughs> fat. <laughs> Robert Wegman. It doesn't work. <laughs> the, and um, yeah, Jeff and Devin from Mad for Electra are both singing on on. A they, they're into that. They do that all over the place. I know so. they're yeah. cheap help. <laughs> yeah. You know they'll show up for anything. Give them something to drink. Good, good. Give me some beer. Yeah, they're set and ready for anything. Well, you guys, you'll be playing with them. Um, uh, with Mad for Electro opening up for Fetch and Bones. Yes. This is the second time you're opening up for Fetch and Bones. Yes, it yeah, is. Yeah, we're looking forward to that. Fetch and Bones is a new uh, video out on, I guess, all the video channels and this new song called Love Crushing. Yeah, yeah. It's Super, really great. super song. They're getting better and better. We're real happy to do this show with them. Yeah. We're yeah. also going to be playing with Mad for Electro at Boomerangs on the 1st and 2nd of September. Oh, I didn't know that. So, yes, we are. That's nice. They're doing weekend things now? Yes, they are. Oh. So, um, I was going to say, uh, do you know? Do you know Hope personally? 
from well, uh, I met her. Touch and Bones. But I she sang my guitar. She what? She sang my guitar. She sat on your guitar. Yeah. She signed it. She what? Signed it. Sang it. Autographed it. Oh, signed it. I'm sorry. I thought she said she sat on it and broke it. That would have been that would have been terrible. Mm. Yeah, I've met her, but I mean, I don't really know her like enough to call her up on the phone and say you want to go out and you know. What's the deal with the sh- <laughs> what's, what's the deal with the shirt? The shirt? Just another lizard for peace. It's, it, I got it at the Dead concert. You know. You're into the Dead. No, I actually have never heard anything by them. I just like their clothes. <laughs> <laughs> the tie dye thing. Yeah. Well. Well, that's good. I'd like to thank you guys for coming by. It's a, always a fun... This is the first time we've interviewed, haven't we? This is the yeah. first time we did this type of thing. Yeah, well, Sam and I came to the studio, the old studio, and... Who, oh, on Chris and E.J. Ford's show. Oh, uh, we don't talk about them here. No, no, no. On no, no, no. Um, <laughs> the show. Well, yeah. you got a number to perform live. I, I was ready to go to a tape. I was like, oh, no, you're holding the guitars. I think you're going to play a number live. Yes, we sure do, Sean. We've got a song that was written by Sean Malone here, <laughs> and uh, a song called Follow Me. We're going to do it... At Acoustically. Okay, and, so we're gonna uh, try this now. That fabulous babe will take over the vocals. <laughs> okay, mm-hmm. set it. Check, 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 check. Yeah, one, two, one, two. One, two, three, four. I like that. What was the name of the song again? Follow Me. Follow Me. That's really nice. I'd like to thank you guys for coming up again. It was a really thank pleasure you, having you up. And you can see Multicolor House tonight at the ACL Club in downtown St. Petersburg with Ellis Telly opening up the show. And we got people screaming in the window, what, what, what? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. What time does the show start tonight? Oh, whenever, you know. <laughs> when our drummer gets Nine there. Oh, it depends on that. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Well, thanks very much. I'll see everybody Wednesday night at 9 for the Underground Circus and tune in next Saturday at 4 p.m. for Tampa Inside Out where we will be having Fetch and Bones. Thanks for listening. Good night. Tampa Inside Out has been underwritten by the Alternative Record Store 
11900 North Nebraska Avenue, one block north of Fowler Avenue, Canada.